Hey guys, good morning. Baby wasn't feeling so good yesterday, but now she is, so she started playing with me and we gave her my uh, blue ball that we got from Peter Piper. So uh, we gave it to her and she, she played for a while and then it finally popped because she started like pushing and rolling it and like biting it and I was like throwing it up and she'd be like, ah! like jumping up and trying to get it. And then now, oh, she kind of stopped doing it, but she's still like, she's like got, went into her, she grabbed it like, okay, this isn't a toy now. This is my like, this is my thing. Like you can't have this anymore because it's more like chew toy now. She ran to it and right now it's kind of loose. Like I can probably grab it, but she'll probably snap at me. But earlier it was like under her paw, like her, like her back right there. And she was like, it, it looked like she just like, she was like on it, like, she was staring at me on it, like, you can't have this, this is mine. It was so funny, but she moved it. She's probably like, hey, this started to hurt after a while. You see the doggy? You wanna see it? Look, you see the screen? <gasps> Who's that? Who's that pretty doggy? You look kinda mean right now. She's like, don't do it. Don't do it. Don't take it. Don't worry, I'm not gonna take it. I'm just taking a funny clip of you, because it's so funny. Look, stop, don't do it. Stop, 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 don't do it, don't do it, ah! What is up my clan? Welcome back once again to another Clintus TV vlog. It is Friday, July 31st, the last day of July, and uh, the kids only have like five more days before school starts, and so Tiffany wanted to go and start doing some back to school shopping, not wait the last minute. Even though technically it's only five days, it's kind of waiting the last minute. We're going today. Uh, out to an outlet mall. We're here at Tanger Outlets, in Glendale, Arizona. Cardinal Stadium is right over there. Coyotes Stadium Arena is over there. And um, we're gonna do some shopping. A lot of you guys have been asking, when are you guys going back to school shopping? When are you going back to school shopping? I kept saying, next week, next week. Here we go. Bryce, how was your sleepover? Awesome. Yeah? What'd you and Brayden do? Played Destiny all night. Played Destiny all night? How old time did you go to bed? Um, well, Brayden went. Went to bed pretty early because um, we, we stay, I stayed up and watched the whole movie of Cloudy and the Chains and Meatballs. Oh yeah? Yeah. He fell asleep during the movie? Like it, at the very beginning. Oh much. wow. Do what time was that though? You don't know? You didn't have your watch on? What's the first order of business, Bryce? Ooh. Food. Where are we? Um, fired pie. Fired pie. Very good. Eat pizza. Pizza and salad. All right, Sierra? You can either have it their way or you can have it your way, right? You can, either, you can either order one off their menu or you can build your own, right? It's kind of like Subway. You inspire, we fire. So check it out guys. Custom made salads and pizzas. Bryce, what'd you get on your pizza, dude? Okay, so I got steak, it's called steak and blue. Right. I got steak, I got onions, bell peppers, Mushrooms. And what's the what's the, what makes it blue? Oh yeah, um, blue cheese, and I got light. It's just light, just so there's a hint of it, right? Let's see what you got on your pizza. I got sausage, bell peppers, and classic, right? Classic, classic Sierra. And me and mommy are doing some big old salads. One of your favorite stores next? Yeah. Yep, these are all some clothes I saw in the catalog. Yeah? Yeah. The new styles? Yeah. I saw tights. Cute. I love the There is a section of So Tiffany's already been to three stores and only bought one thing. And that's because why? Because I can't buy stuff that's, on, that's full price. Yes. She does not buy anything at full price. She, if it doesn't say that, she doesn't even look at it. She, she, notice this is the rack that she's looking at out of all this entire store. Now, this is a good store though because there's tons, everything says 50% off. This whole entire store is 50% off, you know that? That's 99%. Look, everything, everything's 50% off. So she can buy everything in this store. And get Sears' entire wardrobe in this store. So Tanger Outlets is pretty cool. It's one of the newer uh, shopping places. It's all outdoors, but it's all covered with big, huge fans. And of course, Bryce, what, did you, what questions did you ask me about the fans? Um, why are they so big? Yeah, but then what'd you say after that? 
there when they, when they get cut off. <laughs> These are the things that are going through my son's my, my head. Is like, if you stick your hand in there, would it chop your hand off? I'm like, yeah, those are huge fans doing going really fast. Yes, it would chop your hand off. It's not sharp. <laughs> it's going fast enough though when it's a blade. It would. It would. Oh, I like them. What size shoe you, Bryce? I don't know. Four or three. I don't know. Those are a three, but how do they feel, Bryce? Three it's and like a half. three and a half. Three and a half. So we're in the Converse store, and they are trying on some high tops, which I... We only had high tops once, but I don't think they're the Converse brand. They were like, just like shoes. Bryce, what do you have here? I have. I see if they have one. She found some. There's two. Here, I'll take this back for you. Did you find them in your size? Oh, but Bryce might have his first pair of slip ons. It's cool because they look like they have laces, but they don't, right? They're laces, you still can't make Well, those are the same. You like those better? Yeah? They don't slip. They don't slip? Just an itty bit, but. An itty bit? Alright, cool. Rock and roll, dude. So we're all done with the outlet mall and we've made our way to the official mall. Uh, starting off here at JCPenney's, one of Tiffany's favorite stores. And usually because they have sales all the time. There's always stuff on sale. They just rotate their sales racks. And Sears already found like, a couple outfits. Mmm, Bryce, how come you're not getting any clothes, dude? Because yes. mommy's not looking for them. Because oh, boys, boys aren't as fun to shop for. That's the problem. All right, you got a little selection here. Gonna try on. What's first? Um, I don't know. Yeah. Yeah. What do you think of your first outfit? I like this. This is supposed to go with the high tops. The purple and cheetah black ones. It's cute. Do a little twirl. The shirts are cute for leggings because it covers your tush. What'd you get, dude? Frappuccino. Mmm. Um, I got a um, double chocolatey chip. Yeah, double. No coffee though, right? No coffee. Sears so trying on outfits, and what? Look at that. I like it. I like it. Strawberry Very cute. Yeah. Mommy, strawberry. I drink like twenty. Thumbs up, Sierra. Thumbs up. I like it. So, how many outfits did you pick out, Sierra? About four. About four. Cute. Lots of good stuff. I hear Bryce. Bryce is trying on something right now. Can't wait to see it. Oh, I think Bryce is ready. All right, let's take a look, Bryce. Let's see what you got. Oh, dude. That's perfect. Is that your first day of school outfit? Yeah. Here, come over here real quick. Come over here. I got some shoes for you, too. Oh, perfect. Well, there we go. Back to school shopping is pretty much done as far as the clothes go. Um, we obviously still have to do the uh, back to school supplies, uh, but we have to go meet the teachers on Monday, get the supply list, and then we'll uh, we'll probably go do shopping on Tuesday before they actually start school and get the kids uh, school supplies. We'll show you guys all, all the stuff the kids got here shortly, but first uh, we gotta start making dinner because it's already 6.20, almost 6.30, and my belly's starting to rumble. Uh oh, watch out, Sears back in the kitchen. You have mommy out with the uh, dinner? Yep. What do you got there? Some rice aroni, some beef flavored rice aroni, and I smell like sausage, turkey sausage? Turkey. Ground turkey. Ground turkey. Mm hmm. So we laid out what we bought today, and this is just kind of a start. They obviously have some clothes that they can wear to school, but no. You have to have some new clothes, huh? Yes. So it's about a week's worth, and then they can start mix and matching what they have in their closets already. All right, so you wanna go first? Because I think you're a little more excited about this than oh Bryce is. So starting off on this side, this is just like a, like a blouse, but it's super long. So it's just like, you wear it over something and then it goes like all the way down right there. Okay. Dress. Cute. Cheetah. This outfit that we got, it's these tight leggings with this shirt. Mm -hmm. And now this is with my Converse. Um, it's this cheetah shirt, cause it, if you can see the Converse of the cheetah. Mm -hmm. And then these, this purple, in which we didn't bring the shoes into the store, so we didn't know if everything was gonna match for it, which actually this is like the same exact purple. Perfect, perfect. I never dropped that. That's the one with the gum on it, be careful. 
Oh, Ooh, I forgot about that. Oh yeah, me too. Yeah, there's gum on your shoe. You <laughs> yeah. stepped in gum and you haven't even put the shoes on yet. <laughs> there's Watch. a shirt right here. I like that with, a lot. We can, I can either wear these, because mm -hmm. it's got the same colors, or I can wear these pink ones. Perfect. Oh, with jeans jeggings underneath. Yep, I like it. I like that shirt a lot. There's this, we also got it at the Converse outlets. Converse All-Star shirt. Some camo flower sh pants. Mm -hmm. We got these shorts. Shorts they the don't belt. Really, they don't have anything that goes with it. They just just jean them. shorts, they go good. Nike shirt and our other Converse. Love those shoes. Ones. Love those shoes. You got really, you got a lot of, lot of good shoes here. I like all of these. A good lot stuff. of shoes. So right here I have two yellow shirts, one with a skull with glasses and a plain yellow shirt with these bright yellow crazy gimmicks. shorts. I love, I love them. I first built. I love it. And I have these shorts right here, gray, and this. Two these gamer two, shirts. Two gamer shirts. Love those. He was like, Dad, which one should I get? I'm like, get them both. Gaming on the brain, gamer expert level high score holder. Holder. Awesome. And I have these pants, navy blue, and this um, American flag shirt. With some nuts instead of stars. Yeah. And this gray, blue, and red shirt. That matches your matching Converse. Matching with. Match perfectly with these shoes. It's also got these shoes. So yeah, I love the shoes, dude. Seriously, you guys all got good shoes for yeah. school. I love it. I love it. my top. I love my Converse. I love oh, my that, that and their feet are getting bigger. Absolutely. Tiffany and Sierra almost wore the same size shoe. Give her, I think, six more months and they will be literally wearing the same shoes. No, it will probably be a lot less. Those are size four and kids, though. <gasps> They're size four and kids. A little snug. A little, little small. Almost little small. though. Almost there. Like six more <laughs> oh, months. Oh, funny. You never wear pink. Six more months. Shoes. You always wear like brown and black. Well, there you go, guys. That's uh, their kids' new clothes for school for now. Like, basically, it's a week's worth of clothes. And then after that, like Tiffany, they'll mix and match some of their old stuff. Um, and then, of course, as time goes on, new styles change. Actually, all the back to school sales go on. And uh, you know, then you start buying little, little, and then it's, then then the seasons change, and they start buying winter clothes, stuff that gets a little longer, a little, little thicker, uh, hoodies, jackets, that sort of thing. And so we'll do this all over again uh, in the fall. Fastest dinner ever. Just in time for the last bite. You yeah, inhaled it, man. A little quick, little goulash action. Mm -hmm. Good. Everybody's good. Everybody's sitting in different seats. It seems like no, just me and you. Me and you switched. Switch, switch, people, switch. Check this out, you guys. It's been raining off and on the last few hours. Whoa, what? what? And look at that sunset. How? Even what? What? <laughs> How is it so bright orange? Yeah, the camera's not really doing it justice, you guys. How is it so bright orange? Because it's just the sunset hitting the clouds. But like, I, just looking through the blinds, it looked like it was all on fire. Now it's kind of like purple. It's good though. Pretty and that, ladies and gentlemen, is our Friday. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, be sure to give it a thumbs up. Uh, quick favor to ask, my buddy Eric from Eric TV 365 today is his birthday, and uh, I tweeted him. I tweeted and you know gave him a shout out there. But uh, do me a favor, go over to his channel, youtubecom TV 365 and leave a comment on his video. Right. So um, I don't know when I don't know when his birthday video I don't know when his videos go up, but basically today's his birthday, which means. Tomorrow, when this video goes up, his video will go up. Um, they went to a baseball game. It was the D-backs versus the Astros. Go to that video and wish him a happy birthday. Tell him I sent you. Uh, tell him you're, you're, you're a member of the Clintus clan and wish him a happy birthday because he's a really good guy. Um, him and I stayed, we bunked up together for my very first VidCon three years ago, um, or I guess technically two years ago. Um, he's a good guy overall, um, does daily vlogs like us. And uh, just go wish him a happy birthday and give him some love. Check out some of his videos. And um, yeah, I'd appreciate it if you did that for me. Tomorrow is Saturday, and as of right now, at this exact moment, we have no plans. Uh, we we're trying to make some plans with some friends. I'm not sure if they're going to go through or if they're going to fall through. Um, but uh, either way, it's Saturday, and uh, it's the kids' last weekend before uh, they go back to school. So I'm sure we'll do something. Uh, we still have a lot of crap to do around the house, so part of me feels like we'll probably just stay home and get work some stuff done. Part of me is like, heck no, we're going to get up and get out of the house. So uh, stay tuned, check back tomorrow for that, and uh, we'll see you then. Vlog on.